Hello guys, welcome to Excel series. As we have learned everything about Excel and VBA editor, I have told you about each and every button. Today we will learn about VBA. What is VBA? So VBA stands for Visual Basic for Applications. Why we are learning about it? Because it is related with Excel and you can automate your work by using Visual Basic. It can automate your task, create button and make Excel smarter. You can find VBA editor under the developer tab and you can find Visual Basic on the left corner. You can either open Visual Basic by clicking here or pressing the shortcut Alt F11. We will open it by clicking over here and we got a VBA editor here. As we are just starting, I will not show you a single code today. We will learn from basic macro recording today. So I have name of my students and then I have their score. And I want to highlight the highest score in green. So what I will do, I can just go to conditional formatting and do my work. But if I have more and more subjects and classes and I have to do the same thing again and again, I will avoid doing this again and again. For example, I will select the score and go to home tab and here we have conditional formatting so i can just go over here and i can go to top 10 percent and then i can select the color to green and then select okay so i i did this once but what if i have to do it again and again i will not go over here and click on again and again so i will show you how you can automate your world by using macro recording without writing a single formula so what we will do is we will go to developer tab and here we will record a macro what i will do is i will click on the record macro button we will get this dialog box so here i can create a macro for my cells so I can reuse it again and again without going to the many options. So what we will do is we will name this macro. We will name it as highlight high scores and then we can give a shortcut. I will give it as control A and you can write the description as well and you can save in your this workbook new workbook or personal macro workbook so you can use it everywhere you want to and then select okay so we'll save it to this workbook and then we can select a shortcut key and a macro and then select okay now we are recording the macro so you can see here you can stop recording now so the macro has started so the steps we will do now it will record it and save it for us so what we will do is we will select our scores and then go to home tab and here we have conditional formatting we will go to top bottom rules and then top 10 percent and we will change change color to green fill with dark green and then select okay now go back to the developer tab again and then stop this macro now our macro is saved you can find it over here highlight high scores and then you can step into it if you want to see the code but we don't want to get into code because we are just learning to record a simple macro so i have deleted the older scores now i have new scores and i want to apply that again so what i will do is so i don't have to do all the steps of conditional formatting again and again i can use my macro which was already recorded by going over here and run this macro or by pressing the control A. Look, you can see now I have did the same thing but without going into conditional formatting and apply all the steps again. You now know how to record a simple macro and how to reuse it again and again. So if you like this video, press the like button and follow for more videos like this. Thanks for watching this video.